pounds of red hot cherry jello this is a jello that is made from our family for years so what i'm going to add to it now is the kaolin clay we need 16 half teaspoons and then i'm going to put two in there and then the rest in the fragrance So I did six teaspoons in here, or um, sorry, three teaspoons in here, and the rest will be in there. And that's just gonna absorb the fragrance and help it when it goes through the chemical process. Next is buttermilk, and I'm gonna add um, probably four teaspoons. So I'll need eight of these. One, two, Three, six, seven, eight, and then the ghost milk, we're going to add ten. So we'll have five, two, measuring out the hard oil she's working on the coconut right now which is 39 ounces of coconut oil and then there will be like 41 ounces of lard so we'll bring you back when we're getting everything ready to come okay guys so that's Ooh. our lard um and our coconut oil our water our soft oils with all the additives fragrance with the kale and clay in it and this is nut 20 ounces of lye. So I'm gonna make the lye water and then I'll bring you back as we're melting everything down. So I am stirring in the lye and melting it down the solid oils and then we're gonna add in the liquid oils. So we'll bring you back. Adding in the liquid oil and all the additives. That's all the good stuff. So she'll scrape it in and then we'll make that. Okay, now we're gonna stir and bring this to a mold in and then divide it. And Hannah's gonna show us our colors. The first color is trial by fire. Pretty. Really red. red. Okay, and the next color? Brick by dust or brick dust. Brick <laughs> dust by nurture. And then we're gonna add in some titanium dioxide. And then we're gonna put these into four of the three inch column molds that are at bevelsbarn.com. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go mix this and then I'll bring you guys back Let's when we're spitting it off. So this is the trial by fire. So red. And then in here is the brick dust. This brick dust is actually one of my favorite colors. Now. So we're gonna go stir these up and then in another bowl, we're gonna do an in the pop swirl so that we can pour them into the mold. Oh, I have to add fragrance. I thought you guys would like to see my mess. So that soap seized. Um, only the red seized, the white didn't, but I just threw them in there anyway. 
So we'll let them cure and then cut them and they might be potential rebatches.